A mosaic classroom, by definition, is a classroom that supports active learning. Mosaic tile-like squares in reds, blue, and white form a circle made up of four concentric circles, active learning classrooms, transforming teaching and learning. And Leftwich, Associate Professor, School of Education, Indiana University. When we're looking at mosaic classrooms, we really want um, furniture as well as technology that is flexible and movable. School of Education, 2015. In a classroom, two rows of wide tables with four computers on each table. On the wall next to each table, a larger monitor. Students sit in chairs on wheels. In the center of the room are three hexagonal tables on wheels. One student stands in the center of the room using a tablet. The instructor walks among the tables. At the front of the classroom are two whiteboards and a large screen. And when we're specifically talking about technology, making sure that it is seamless and ubiquitous so that students can quickly move from the technology to face-to-face -to -face interactions and it doesn't become something that's blocking them from being able to talk with someone else. Collaborative Learning Studio, SB015. A tall rectangular room with a peaked ceiling. Tall windows at one end. Students sit around U-shaped tables with monitors at the end of each table. A larger screen is on one wall. Across the room stairs lead to a raised platform. So this space was the start of something big for us where we took what we learned and we built other spaces with similar features. Julie Johnston, Director, Learning Spaces, UITS, Indiana University. So in Indianapolis, our spotlight space, LE104, is a collaborative learning studio that took a lot of the same features because of the success here in Bloomington. Stacy Moroni, Associate Vice President, Learning Technologies, Indiana University. The initiative is called the Mosaic Initiative because it reflects the wide range, or mosaic, of different types of classrooms that we have across Indiana University. A view of several classrooms. Franklin Hall, 114. Collaborative Learning Studio, the 104. Kirkwood Hall, 016. Collaborative Learning Studio, SB015. Classroom features include multiple windows, large screens on one wall, smaller monitors at the ends of group tables, individual laptops or desktops in front of each student, chairs on wheels, microphones in the center of tables. And we really are embarking on trying to make as many of our classrooms active learning enabled as possible, which is the primary goal of, of the Mosaic initiative. Mosaic classrooms right off the bat. Rob Elliott, lecturer, computer information technology, IUPUI. Kind of take the students out of what their expectations for the technology are, what their expectations for the room are, and kind of force them to think in a different way uh, from day one. Students are really excited. John Rasick, senior lecturer, School of Art and Design, Indiana University. To use the, the VR. In Kirkwood Hall, 016. A student wearing virtual reality glasses holds a tool up in front of her and draws in the air. Color swatches streak across the large screen on the wall in response. She moves her arm in a circle creating an explosion of stars on the screen behind her. Her mouth opens in a wide O. Other students watch and laugh. That has changed how my students are thinking about design and thinking about uh, prototyping. So they're able to uh, create spaces, uh, create objects, and then immediately test them out in full scale. In another classroom, students sit on the floor in a circle and control a small blue robot on the floor between them with tablets in their hands. Other students move a robot on a tabletop. I think that this particular type of classroom has actually enhanced my students' creativity with the technology. Um, they're gonna be future educators, so thinking about how they can use technology to really transform, it's just pushed them to a new level of understanding. Dennis Growth, Vice Provost, Undergraduate Education, Indiana University. There's a great deal of research that has looked at the difference in what students learn based upon passive teaching and learning activities, the lecture format compared to active teaching and learning classes where students are actively solving problems. The Mosaic classrooms are uniquely designed to support enhanced collaborative activities. The ability to create classrooms is just the first step. 
but to take it to the next level and have an initiative where everyone's on the same page and we have a shared vision and we all know where we're going is really the recipe for a transformation. UITS.IU.EDU forward slash mosaic. University Information Technology Services. Copyright 2017. The Trustees of Indiana University.